Injuries are certainly nothing new for the Edmonton Eskimos, and while the bye week has definitely helped with healing some guys up and hopefully bringing them back in time for the upcoming Labor Day series against the West Division first place Calgary Stampeders, the Edmonton Eskimos will be without starting center Aaron Fiaconi for the rest of the season. That's extremely frustrating. Uh, extremely, extremely frustrating. I, mean, I love this locker room, man. I've been here five yeah. years. And, uh, you know, any, anyone who's a competitor would want to do something about their team. But I'm going to do whatever I can now uh, in the circumstances I'm in to help these guys get better. At the same time, some of the receivers who went down all at once, like, you know, slot back at Darius Bowman. The body's doing great. Uh, ran out, uh, got out of uh, the right testing done, got our x-rays looked at, and uh, everything's healing fine and looking good. And uh, I'm going to take it day by day, but as of right now, I feel great. I'm practicing. I'm up and ready. Head coach Kavis Reed isn't putting any added pressure on his players. Even though they have a chance to get first place back with a couple of wins over Calgary in a row here. I'm going to say less now and just do a little bit more. It's, it's, it's time for them to start to assert their their maturity versus me trying to always lead them. The Edmonton Eskimos travel down south to take on the Calgary Stampeders at McMahon Stadium on Labor Day for the annual Classic, of course, before coming back up to Commonwealth four days later for the rematch. For Sun Media, I'm Jerry Montajon.